at home on the seven seas. Cruise liners from Mayagaft. Ships are built in Papenburg on the River Ems for customers all over the globe. They are built in large covered dry docks. Since 1987, all ships have been built under the protection of the hall roof. Computer animation of building workflows at the shipyard. Steel construction is done in halls 7 to 9. Section construction in halls 1 to 4. Block construction and hull assembly are carried out on the two roofed dry docks. The second dock is to be extended by 120 meters in 2008. During prefabrication, individual steel plates and profiles are laser welded to create so called flat sections. In various production units, plates, profiles, and side walls are joined to form sections. About 10 sections make up a block. Cabling, pipelines, and air conditioning ducts are installed during section and block construction. The blocks are welded together to make up the whole ship. A ship with a registered tonnage of 90,000 consists of about 70 blocks. The Zilia Europa and the Ponta Ven provide proof of the shipyard's know-how when it comes to building ferries. Neptun Werft in Rostock, a sister enterprise of Meyer Werft, is also successful in the river cruise liner sector. But back to the luxury liners. The Oriana and the Aurora were delivered to the British shipping company P&O in 1995 and 2000. Swimming pools, English pubs and luxurious penthouse suites. The ships offer something to suit every taste. The luxury liners for NCL are equipped with modern port drive. Thanks to this innovative technology, which allows for the engine pod to rotate by 360 degrees, it was possible to improve the maneuverability of these 294 meter long ships considerably. The four ships of the Radiance class also set new standards for interior finishing and ship design. Thanks to the Ems barrier, ships with registered tonnages of up to 180,000 tons can be built in Papenburg and conveyed down the Ems. The new ships for Celebrity and Disney have registered tonnages of 122 and 124,000 respectively. These ships feature countless technical design innovations. The first two new club ships for AIDA cruises were delivered in 2007 and 2008, and four more will be delivered by 2012. Luxury liners by Maya Werft of Palmenburg. Dream ships which will continue to inspire people in the future as well.